We are taking a look at the progress reports for our children's schools for the first time since the pandemic started. Katy, Montgomery, Pearland, and Cypher are among the districts receiving A's. HISD, Fort Bend, and Conroe getting above average marks, each earning B's, along with Spring, Klein, Aleaf, and Humble. Aldine got a C and one HISD school went from an F to an A in just two years. ABC 13 reporter Daniela Hurtado has a closer look at the state of schools across our area. The single most important in school factor that infects the lives of our students is the teacher in the classroom. Teachers are the heart of the educational system, the backbone of the success of the positive ratings across our area school districts. Students excelling in schools like Wheatley High School. This is not only huge in terms of Wheatley and being a win, it's huge for the, the Wheatley community. For eight years, their school was marked low performing. Now they're ranked a C school. As we get back to school, the teacher shortage is a topic of conversation. They have more teachers employed in the state of Texas than in every other state in the country, including California. We have more teachers currently employed in, uh, in Texas than we ever have before. And what we also have more openings than we ever have before. Vacancies that still need to be filled. Thousands of teachers left the profession across the state just last year. We have inspected, we collectively, public education has inspected every exterior door to make sure it's functioning, it closes, it locks. School safety stays top of mind. This summer, staff has undergone training on safety drills and how to study the behavior of students who appear threatening. Those staff get special training on how to then intervene so that we can prevent those um, uh, escal those those threats from escalating into something more significant. So that is happening across all 9,000 campuses, all 1,200 school systems. So while school ratings are out, many are preparing for the new year to tackle challenges and put the children first. In Houston, Daniela Hurtado, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.